Well, the good news for all you iPhone and iPad users out there is with iOS 7, Apple have improved the relationship with Google and the way we can add our accounts using Google. So the first thing we'll do is find our settings app and launch the settings and scroll down on the left hand side to mail, contacts and calendars. Tapping on that we get the option to add a new account. So if we add an account and this is where the big changes occur and this is great for both staff and students if we now have an option called Google. So when we tap on Google both staff and students are able to enter their details here. So I've got a demo student called Bill Space Blogs. And did you notice I didn't need to type a capital for Bill Blogs? Now I don't want to correct the spelling, that's how the name is spelt. And Bill is email, is a student, and this is blogs B01. And it's an email address. So for students, we're at Dow Stew, and for staff, we're just at dow.catholic.edu.au. So once again, students put their email, their 01 email address at Dow Stu, Catholic Edu AU, and staff would be, of course, just at Dow, Catholic Edu AU. Capitals for the email address, like the capital surname and initial, is merely cosmetic. You can use those if you like. The password for Bill, very secret. And the description for the account, well, I might call this one Google Dow <coughs> Cloud. You can call it whatever you like. Press return or tap next. Verifying of the account takes place. All ticks. And at this stage, we choose what we want to set up. So for students, you would leave definitely mail context calendars. And if you're already using Dow Cloud, sorry, if you're already using iCloud for notes, don't cloud your notes again in Google. Just use the one cloud service. If you're not clouding notes at all, then leave that checked. For staff here, staff, we would turn off mail most cases because we can't receive any Google Mail. We already get our mail with our school mail system. Students, however, would leave mail on. Staff could leave the mail on. You won't receive any Google Mail, but you certainly will be able to send mail through that service as well. It's up to you. Tap Save, and it's all done. In particular, students, once you've added your account, you would go back to your apps screens and in this and check your mail and that mail all works. I don't know where the mail app is on this iPad, so what is I'll pull down from any application on the screen and search for mail and AIL tap and it finds the mail app and launches it. And there is all the mail added and check for mail by pulling down, etc. So the mail is all working and good.